Chiplet technology is getting more and more attention. So how the IP vendors motivated or driven by heterogeneous integration approaches? Uh, I think the chiplet is uh, only an emerging technology today. So big companies like Intel, NVIDIA, AMD have the resources to manage a chiplet program, but uh, it's very new for IP vendors. They used to sell IP and that's it. Will they provide chiplet instead of IP? Uh, it's my guess if you want, but it will take some time. It's a market-driven business. If, if they see an important source of revenue, they will be motivat- motivated to develop chiplet. So my guess is that the IP vendor will probably start as a third party of uh, chip makers. In other words, they, they will not invest up front. They will wait for the customer to pay for it. According to the US SIA data, EDA core IP suppliers have invested a lot of money in R&D. Why is that so? I think the answer in uh, in their business model, because um, it's frequent to see that IP vendors have a 95% margin because the cost of revenue is doesn't almost does not exist. It's a computer you are using, but compare with um, an equipment supplier, it's really nothing. If you want R&D is not accounted as as a cost of revenue. It's an upfront investment. So their margin is uh, so high, but if they want to do business, they have to invest upfront in R&D. And they have enough money because of their business model, where the margin is very close to 100%. You said that one-stop business model is very important. So could you give me an example? If we talk about other EDA vendors, I only know um, Mentor, which has been bought by Siemens, with uh, the same size, mm. and Mentor has already stopped do- developing IP. So let's say we make it uh, that. Then the question becomes: Other uh, IP vendor could they develop a one-stop shop business model? Very, very difficult. For example, Synopsis. Do you have an idea of the number of uh, designer? working only on uh, design IP development. Now I'm talking about the engineers, the people you have to pay every month to, to develop uh, IP. 3,000 designers, huge, a huge number. Synopsis and Candence are very successful EDA design companies. Is there such a company in China? It took them uh, 25, 25 years to reach this Label. Your uh, synopsis uh, bought uh, in silicon, I think in uh, 98 uh, or 2000. They never stopped acquisition of IP vendor. So they built it. Uh, it's uh, the result of 20 years strategy. To be honest, I don't know very much the China's market. I'm aware of a company named Barry Silicon. And if we look, uh, very second is probably the um, IP vendor, which is uh, the, the closer to be a one-stop shop um, company. Because if you look at their um, portfolio of IP, it's uh, very impressive. So the answer is it's not impossible. It's very difficult. There could be companies, very few, and very second could be an example.